and welcome to Gusto News on Gusto TV Africa. My name is Imar. And on today's news, we have Whiskey, we have Rama, we have Arista, and we have the queens, the OGs, but this one in the female categories in the industry. I'm talking about Tiwa Savage, you know, Niniola, Waje, Simi. We are going to be talking about all of these amazing ladies on the news today but before going on to what we have for you on today's news guys i'll say thank you for all that you do for us here on the channel we see all of it and really do appreciate you and if you're coming across the channel for the very first time please do not forget do not forget you know to subscribe and also do not forget to click on the post notification bell so as to know when we you know drop new videos or when we drop new content like the latest just for you here on the channel all right guys so starting off we have big whiz mm -hmm. Whiskey has just been chilling like i've been following him like up back to back like this guy has just been chilling like having the best time of his life like recently he was in paris for the dior fashion show and it was really 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 beautiful he was you know what we had rema we had ruga we had naomi yes whiskey and naomi actually have like a very beautiful relationship like yes whiskey has been having you know the time of his life and last time we had whiskey on the news was because of temps and we also had, you know, Davido alongside. People came out to really talk about Whiskey and Thames' success and also Thames' and Davido's success, comparing the songs that they've had together in the past. But we, another reason, yes, when we had him on the news was because of this particular award yes best collaboration man there's been a whole lot of talks people coming out to say a whole lot of things you know whiskey is the reason why the song did this terms is the reason why the song did this day so people said it's justin bieber like it's just a whole lot but then you know whiskey has taken home the award there's nothing we can do we cannot go and collect it back from him he has received the award is that he has actually received it but the reason why we have a whiskey on the news today is because of made in lagos this album this album is actually very very stubborn i'm going to actually add it to the list of my very stubborn albums made in lagos is on that list of albums that are here to stay for a very very long time not just made in lagos you know even made in lagos deluxe like those albums are here to stay for a very 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 long time all right so this one says whiskey ayos made in lagos album has now spent 86 weeks in the top 10 of the nigerian afrobeat chart extending its record as the album with the most weeks ever on the top 10 like this album is stubborn he doesn't want to go anywhere he said i'm going to be in your face for you know the longest time maybe when we get an album that is actually going to beat made in lagos so maybe that is when you know we're going to stop talking about made in lagos like that but for right now we've got whiskey i've got made in lagos i've also got the songs on this albums doing amazingly amazingly well all right guys away from whiskey and the made in lagos album we have rema and iris star the last time we had Arastar in the news was because she decided to come bash somebody. She decided to make a fan. Should I call that person a fan? Because the fan is not going to troll you. So a troll on Twitter. She decided to make that person shut up. And this was after she posted a very sexy picture. And this person felt like, okay, let me just say something to slush shame Arastar. And she decided to shut him up real quick. I so said the last time we had Rema in the news was because of his interview with Adesha when he went ahead to review, you know, you know, some of the things, some of the personal things about him. So, talking about the death of his father and how he affected him and the fact that he's actually still trying to dig up you know trying to investigate i know what actually took the life of his father because according to rema it was dark like something was actually fishy there's something that actually went down so for right now he's actually trying to actually find that thing that went wrong but the reason why we have this two in the news today is because the celestial being decided to come out to sample rema's calm down it was really beautiful like i actually enjoyed her own version more than rema's version and that's the truth like it was beautiful it was intimate you know when you're actually trying to talk to somebody you love like arasa was doing all of that on this particular song and it was really 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 beautiful and after she actually posted that one rema had to respond saying baby remember they've been shipping this too there have been a ship 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 that has been happening i didn't say anything no but we got twitter they've been saying some things and this actually started from arasa's birthday and now rema is actually coming out to address arasa as baby people are like she people we talk up we talk and say something they happen but since these two have not said anything let's just assume that it's actually just friendship but rema actually reposted saying baby with a love emoji i know that you know really sweet a face like when you actually want to deceive should i say deceive also you want to actually you know get something from somebody so use that emoji and also use the love emoji all right guys away from rema and our style we have the queens of the industry 
the queens of the industry i'm talking about timmy i'm talking about you know tiwa save niniola yemi alade waje so there's been a whole lot of talks about why these ladies have decided not to work together so people said it's beef so people said it's this so people said it's that but yeah some new set of people have actually come out to say these guys have not worked together because of pride and so people are like okay have you guys even decided to even stream the songs of the people that have decided to work together and people are like you know what well, you guys should just stop this comparison if these guys don't want to work together there is nothing Thing we can do but then they're saying the re reason why those ladies are not doing so well in the industry the reason why they're not bagging certifications and going going global is because they have not decided like there's no unity you know in their midst all right so let's go through some of the tweets that were made in regards to this on twitter so this user at big Red dera says you wonder why tiwa savage has never featured simi on the song but we rather feature an outsider brandy and you wonder why Yemi Alade has never featured Simi or Tiwa Savage, but would rather feature one mama that has been singing music since when I was three. These women don't like themselves. So this user is actually coming out to say, you actually, why do you actually just sit down and start, you know, wondering why these ladies have decided not to feature themselves? That the reason why they have decided not to go into the studio and make amazing, you know, music with, by, with themselves is because they do not like themselves these are not my words actually then this user says but we'll be quick to throw in the gender factor as the reason why women are not really popping in the industry like the male artists hate covered with smiles and fake admiration that's what they are all about then this user says even tiny never featured in your life and you expect those collaboration from those ones who feel they are in competition with each other you see those old female musicians i don't know why he went ahead to adjust them as old but these ladies are beautiful do not adjust them as old man guys you guys actually mean on twitter he say you see those old female musicians eh? pride and envy did their body and that's why we may never see any collaboration from them then the issues i went ahead to say nothing like that how many times have you streamed the ones that featured each other yes how many times have you guys you know taken your time to actually go stream the songs of the female artists who have decided to feature each other then this user responded saying shei shei and yemi alade released a song last year none of you all cared shei shei and simi have a song together tiwa savage have a song with waje tiwa savage and Deja has have a song together you all don't even care about these women s the effort so this user is this user is actually coming out to see we have ladies in the industry who have records together talking about sheisha and yemi alade she mentioned simi and sheisha mentioned tiwa savage and waje mentioned tiwa savage and dj and like you guys have not even gone out to stream the songs but you people are the same set of people coming on social media to rant about why these ladies have not you know gone into you know the studio to actually make music with each other and she's saying you all don't care about these women so just keep your mouth shut so tell us in the comment section if you think pride and jealousy or envy is the reason why our female you know artists in the industry have not decided do not actually you know work with each other because according to these users here it's actually pride jealousy and envy so tell us what you think in the comment section and i'll be in the comment section guys responding to some of your comments even not all you see all that you do for us here on the channel i really do appreciate you bye for now my name is emma